If you are caught with pot in the city of Tampa, you could go to jail, lose your license, and pay a big fine. But the city council voted to make pot possession in small amounts similar to getting a traffic ticket. Melanie Michael live at Tampa Police Headquarters for us tonight to explain. Mel, it, when they say small amount, what are they talking about? All right, they're talking about this, Jen. Good evening to you. This is about 20 grams. Now, we want to point out this, of course, is oregano. But if it was the real thing and you got caught with this, for the first time offenders, it'd be a $75 ticket. And boy, does it have a lot of people talking. They didn't hold back. Tampa Bay wants cannabis. Drugs. First and foremost, it's a plant. It was put here on Earth by nature. One by one, people shared opinions at a pot public hearing. I am here this morning as a parent, a parent who does have a child still as an adult who is an addict. And he started in high school with marijuana. The city council wanted to hear what folks in Tampa have to say about weed in small amounts becoming not such a big deal. This is not a get out of jail free card. Tampa's police chief explained this doesn't mean law enforcement is taking it lightly. You'll be ticketed and fined. He claims this is about second chances. This is to target those first-time offenders that have made a mistake and given them the opportunity not to get into that criminal process. When you talk about second chances, we don't mean third, fourth, fifth, sixth. Ellen Snelling is very concerned. Her daughter, she tells us, went from being a straight-A student to a life of addiction, one she says that began with pot. The way it's written right now, it's just they can get a citation multiple times and there's no requirement for any education or any kind of assessment or treatment. So that's what concerns us. So the city council will take up the matter again and has have a final vote, we should say, on March 17th at 9.30 in the morning. And Jen, as you know, so many people are commenting on this tonight. I'd like you to join the conversation. I've started one on my Facebook page, WFLA Melanie Michaels. So join in because a lot of other people already are. Melanie Michael, live for us in Tampa tonight. Thank you, Mel.